everyone. Today I am so excited to share my office reveal in my master bedroom. A couple of things to note before we get started. The first thing is that most of my work is done on my kitchen table, on my living room floor, or in my craft room. This space is dedicated for brainstorming, writing blog posts, journaling, and writing thank you cards. The other thing you'll notice is this place space doesn't have a whole lot of clutter. That's because most of my craft supplies are actually stored in my craft room. And I have it pretty minimalist because I feel that if your space is nice and clutter free, it gives you room to brainstorm and your brain is nice and clutter free. And then the other thing I wanted to note is that you'll see some vintage pieces. As you all know, I love thrifting. And I'm hoping this will inspire you to think outside of the box once more as far as furniture and decor go. Um, a lot of the pieces that I have in my office were not originally intended for an office setting. So have fun with it. Really do what works uh, for you and what speaks to your heart. So without further ado, let's check it out. We're gonna start the tour off with the design inspiration for my office space with this adorable rifle paper company rug. I'm in love with pretty much everything that Rifle Paper Company does, so I really wanted to include some of their pieces in my office space. And then we've got a fun poof that, um, that I pulled from the nursery in my kids' room. And then my basket is right there, and that houses my computer supplies. And then up we go to my desk, which let's start by saying that this desk is actually a workbench that has been modified um, and I use it as my office desk. And I love it because it's so unique, it's so pretty, and it's just wonderful. Um, and I love incorporating pretty pieces, as you'll see here. It uh, really helps with inspiration. And as far as holding my scissors and my pens and note cards and so forth, that goes in this really cute lace container that I got from Ikea years ago. This is where all of my business cards are held, as, long, as well as my thank you cards and my pretty gold um, stapler and scissors. And then this is one of the crowning jewels of this entire space is this Lindsay Letters um, art piece. I wanted one of her pieces for a long time and I thought that this piece just fits so well with uh, the rest of the space. And then I just pulled, I foraged some flowers from our garden and I put them in a thrifted copper pot on top of a cake stand because again, inspiration. So we'll go over here to the next crowning jewel, which is this Deanne Art um, piece. I just find it stunning and it really makes me happy. And we come over here. This is another thrifted piece um, that is in my thrifted stories. And then I like to have things that are visible that inspire me. So the magazines that I really enjoy, I am a sucker for magazines. I probably spend way too much money on magazines, but they give me great inspiration as well as some note cards because I'm always writing things down. And then I've got some of my items that I need to keep for my taxes and so forth, front and center. And then some books that are just inspiring me. Um, I like to have them out so I can view them when I want. And then we've got another thrifted piece here that you'll probably recognize from my thrifting adventures that holds some washi tape and whatever other items I have um, that I just want to set on there. And then inside my cabinet, I've got um, items that I'm working on, uh, projects that are coming up, my fabrics, and just things like that that I can easily get to when I need to. And then some fun things that I just like to play with. Like I've got my embroidery stashed in here and then some lettering books that I've been working on. And then these are just some, uh, I hold my electronics in here and I've got some more magazines. Uh, there's nothing better than actually just reading a magazine and getting inspiration that way. And then all the extra paper that I have. So that is all for my office reveal. I hope you guys enjoyed it and um, go to the blog to check out the full post where I got everything. And until next time, I hope you'll have a wonderful day. Thank you guys. <music>